What does work done mean? In physics, work done simply means energy transferred by a force as it acts upon an object that's moving. The thing is that object has to be moving in the same direction as the force for any energy transfers to happen. So let's make a definition of work done and we'll do a few examples and then we'll answer this flashcard. So here's the definition of work done that we need to learn. So work done is the energy is the energy transferred by a force acting on an object which is moving by distance in the direction of the force and that's really important it has to be moving at a distance in the direction of the force so for example let's take a car that uh, is being accelerated by the forward thrust of the engine so there's the engine's forward thrust and the car has a, uh, a mass and therefore it is accelerating and let's say it moves through a distance say it moves from there to there distance d now because it's moved in a distance which is in the same direction parallel to the force work is being done energy is being transferred from the chemical energy in the petrol to the kinetic energy of the car energy is being transferred work is being done well what happens if the car wants to break it's going really fast let's say and we slam the brakes on now there's a, a force which is acting backwards now to slow down the car it's a braking force it's already moving really quickly so we're decelerating the car and the car is still going to move a distance as it slows down distance D and that distance it moves is still in the same direction parallel to the force so we're still doing work but now the energy transfers are different we're going from the kinetic energy of the car and the brakes are heating up to heat energy in the brakes or thermal energy in the brakes so kinetic energy in the car to heat energy in the brakes and that kinetic energy is therefore being transferred to heat and it's therefore slowing down the car work is still being done by the brakes by the braking force I hope that makes sense so let's take a look at these examples on the flashcard and see if we can answer them so is work being done if you launch a space rocket Okay, so our first example, a space rocket. So here we go, here's a uh, very dodgy looking space rocket. Oh, it's an advanced, advanced design. And uh, we've got an upwards thrust force from the rocket engines. And it's going to be moving a distance in a certain time. And that distance is in the same direction as the force. So work is indeed being done. Being done. Energy is being transferred. And we're transferring from chemical energy in the fuel of the rocket to kinetic energy of the rocket as it moves faster and gravitational potential energy as it gets higher and higher. So work is being done. What about the second example? A student pushing against a wall. OK, so here's our wall and uh, here's our student looking a bit frustrated because the wall is probably not going anywhere. So they're applying a force on the wall. But the wall's not moving. There's no distance. So work is not being done. There's no energy transfer happening here. Work is not being done. There is no energy transfers. 
taking place. Now I know that student's going to get a bit tired after a while of pushing against a wall and that's due to the inefficiencies of those students' muscles. Um, we have a system, a body system, which um, even if we're just standing still, it's still converting chemical energy into heat so that we can stay alive. Um, and uh, if our muscles are tensed, they may not be doing any work. They may not be transferring any chemical energy into, let's say, kinetic energy, but they are still transferring a little bit of, of, uh, of their chemical energy into heat. In fact, quite a lot. So what about the third example? A postman carrying a heavy parcel on level ground. Okay, so here's our level ground. Here's our postman or woman carrying a very big package. Oh, excuse the drawing. Let's try again. There we go. Right. Is that postman or woman doing any work? Well, where's the force here? Well, he or she is having to hold up the parcel to stop it from falling to the ground. So the force is upwards and the postman is walking a distance D on level ground. So let's say that he or she moves that distance. But the problem here is that the distance is not in the direction of the force. In fact, they're completely unrelated because they're at 90 degrees. And that means that no work is being done. So work is not being done. There are no energy transfers. It would be a different situation if you asked that postman to lift up that heavy package through a distance in the same direction as the force. Then it would be like a weightlifter. That postman would be doing work and what would the energy transfers be? Well, it would be chemical energy in the postman's muscles being transferred to gravitational potential energy as the parcel is raised up. But just walking along level ground, work is not being done. There's no energy transfers. Energy transfers. I hope that's been of some help in understanding what work done means. And make sure that you can, um, you can explain this definition. It's the energy transferred. That's all it is. It's just energy transferred by a force acting on an object which moves by a distance in the direction of the force. Very important.